Dries van Bergen from um, Belgium-based design studio Unfold. We are a studio that focuses mainly on the intersection between digital making and physical making, what happens when the two uh, intersect with each other, and more importantly, what implications has that on our role as designers, on our profession and our industry in general. Of instruments and archetypes was born out of the copying of a set of objects by Christopher Dresser, which is an industrial designer who made these decanters out of glass and silver. And when we copied that, we noticed that we needed something to measure that variety and to translate them directly to the computer. So this is the digital caliper. It's made out of uh, brass and uh, wood. And you measure a physical glass object and another stick-like object that you want to use as a handle. And the object dynamically and in real time on the screen changes based on those measurements. So instead of measuring and then noting down those measurements and transferring them to the computer, your measuring tool becomes a making tool because you're directly and physically uh, changing the model that's on screen. So in the end you get a 3D printed part that's a connector and that connects two real world objects, a handle and a jug, into a new object, a decanter. We used actual insights of digital measuring tools but then moved them into a different language that also adheres to our notion of what a tool should look like and we also wanted to make it less technical and make it more of something that you could see laying around your own cabinet at home like on the cupboard or something. One thing we want to do is uh, release the tool as an as a open tool combined with software APIs. One option is for makers and designers to directly talk with their computer programs so that people can actually use it in Rhino or use it to develop iPad apps. But the way we always envisioned it is more of a way of customization for consumers. So we see it as kind of an essential tool in an ecosystem of digital manufacturing and 3D printing. I think the time when we were either against or pro-digital tools is becoming irrelevant because you cannot remove digital anymore from our daily life. So I think we should stop thinking as either one or zero and start thinking of where we can embed it like everywhere in our, um, in our daily life, in our, in our practice of makers.